guys, today we're gonna talk about my everyday makeup look. It takes me like 20 to, 15 to 20 minutes to do this. Um, you've seen it on Instagram plenty of times. So this is, I'm gonna, I'm gonna walk you through all the steps and the products. So let's get to it, shall we? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Alina. If you've never been to my channel, welcome. And if you've been here before, then welcome back. This is going to be my first makeup tutorial. I've never done one before, but I get asked a lot uh, to, do, to do one. So I'm just going to do my everyday simple makeup tutorial. Right now I don't have anything on. I just moisturize and I wear I always wear eye cream. So I have eye cream and moisturizer and we're gonna get to work. I do my eyes first and then face makeup. I know there are people that do face makeup first and then eyes. Whichever one you want to do first, but I like to start off with eyes. This is one of my all-time favorite products, and I've been using this, I could say for years. It's this uh, eye primer by Trish. So I just put it on my eyes and I like to use my fingers to blend it in you have to like with this stuff you have to like move quick because it dries out but then it's not like it makes your eyelids really dry after you put it on but you have to work fast if everybody wonders why how my eyeliner stays on all day this is how so once we blend this thing in the next step is I wear like a I set my uh, primer with a really light color eyeshadow. That's what we got here. This is a um, palette by Too Faced. And I'm gonna be using the color, this one, Eggnog. That one. I just like how when my eyes look like nice and bright. So we do that. And the other side. And oh, when I wear this primer, my eyeliner stays on all day. Like, seriously, I could go in the pool, I can do everything, I can go to the gym, I can do hot yoga, and that thing is not gonna move. But it does come off easily. I'm no makeup artist, by the way. So, but this is just what I do that was that works. This is what I do and that's what works for me. What I'm gonna do next is I have to wear eyeliner. I cannot leave the house without wearing an eyeliner. And of course, Bobbi Brown Gel Liner is my all-time favorite. For my eyeliner, I like to use an angled brush like this one. Doo -doo. I do that. And try to get as close as you can to your lash line. And then you can build it up. If you want a thicker line, then you can build it up. But I like to get as close as possible. And then give it a little wing. You can always come back and touch it up. Now I'm moving on to this other guy. It's always a struggle when you have eyelash extensions because they get in the way. Next, I like to do my brows. I mean, I have, I'm Middle Eastern, so I already have like a full set of brows, like a yoni brow. So my doing brows does not take long. I just have like some bald spots that I have to fill in and I love using the Benefit precisely to brow pencil. I think I, think I use number four, it is three or four. It's not on here. Hard. So I go in in this motion. Have you guys noticed that we make the funniest faces when we're doing makeup? Like, I'm trying to look cute. So that's that. And I always have like a spot here. Look at that! Would you look at that? Moving on to this guy. 
Everybody has their own way of doing it. Um, this is what works for me. As I said, I am no makeup artist. Doing this because you guys asked for a makeup tutorial and I'm here to please and to provide. Don't look over there. And I look decent. Next step would be a face primer. I always like to wear a face primer because my makeup just looks flawless all day. And my all time favorite primer, which I have so many. Every time I travel, I bought it. I buy it from the airport. It's, just, it's so cheaper at the airport. It's the YSL blurring pr primer. It's the, it's the gold one. Do a couple of pumps. And then. So now that my face is all primed and ready, it's time for a foundation. So my favorite foundation is the Dior Air Flash. But the bad thing about it is that they don't have a big color selection. So three, I use 301 mixed with 401 because 301 is too light for my skin and 401 is too dark. So when I mix this two, I get the perfect shade. So that's what I'm gonna do. It's a spray foundation. You can like literally spray it on your face, but I don't like doing that because then it gets in my eyelashes and eyebrows and stuff. So I have one of these things and I'm gonna mix the two colors on here. Go with a 301. Oh, you gotta shake this. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. Shake it. After you shake it, you just, I just do a little spray there of 301 and a darker shade, 401. <laughs> I just take my finger, da da da, just put it on my face. And I love using a beauty blender to blend. I, whoever came up with that beauty blender is a genius. Blending is the most important part of this makeup. And I have a lot of friends that they're like, um, if this beauty blender doesn't work, I don't know how you do it, it looks so perfect. And then I find out that they, didn't, they don't wet it. So yeah, wet your beauty blender, guys. So we're just gonna dab, 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 blend, 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 blend. This is basically like my daily routine. My quick um, makeup when I don't have time and I don't want to like try out new products. And I, these are the ones that I know like, it's great and it works. By the way, this air flash looks amazing in the pictures. All my friends are hooked on and they all use that. So now that it's all blended, it's concealer time. I like to use two different concealers, the Tarte one, but this dries out my under eye, so what I like doing is I'll put this one on first and then I'll come in with the Flash Dior Flash Luminizer because this is kind of like moisturizing like a treatment so then my under eyes does not look that uh, dry. Most people put it on their face. I'm probably wasting a lot of product but I put it on my beauty blender and then I dab it in. I like my under eyes a lot lighter than my foundation. Just a little bit here too to make them brighter. And, uh, and then I come in with the end that I use with my foundation to kind of like blend it all in. So then, just to blend it all in. When you blend enough, like we'll blend, 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 blend. I usually have uh, two um, beauty blenders because after the other one, I like to go in with another clean one to dab more. After that, it's time to set it. I like to set my foundation because I don't touch up my foundation throughout the day. I like using the Laura Mercier setting powder is one of my favorite. I take a beauty blender and I put a little bit in the lid. Take that, put 
hooded a leather blend blend set this thing in place now time for blush bronzer what whatever you want to call it so where's my where's my brush do you guys know where my brush is I do I do okay um I'm not this is my everyday makeup I'm not gonna contour I'll just do oh I'm using the Mac um, kiss me sun kiss like the label came off so I don't know what it is I think it was like sun kiss uh, give me some give me sun give me sun that's what it was so what I'm gonna do is just put it on my cheek and frame my face just give it some warmth so kind of sort of contouring but not really Okay, enough of goofing around. We're gonna move to the highlighter portion. So I I told you guys that I wear two different concealers. I like to go at the end with the Dior one, just so that my under eyes are not really dry when I'm smiling. So I like to go in with this guy. And I like to use the pointed tip of the Beauty Blender to blend this in. And then we use a highlighter. I like the, my everyday one that I love using is the YSL one. Oh God, this is dirty. You know what happens when you drop your makeup? I hope it's not broken. I'll be so sad if it is broken. Oh no, no, I broke it. But look how pretty it is. Just a little bit here and the tip of my nose. And I also like the brush with the pointy end. Do this. I like to try to keep my eyes pretty basic for my everyday, but I do wear full face makeup. At the end, like very end. After I'm done with everything, I'll take this setting powder with this little fluffy brush, tap it all over my face to make sure everything like blends in and there's like no lines, just lightly, like not much product. And after that's done, we're gonna use setting spray. <laughs> I like using the Urban Decay setting spray. Because I don't like the powdery look, so I would like it to be more dewy, so I always wear this. So just... <sighs> it smells bad, but uh, it smells disgusting, actually. But it's kind of refreshing. So that's my everyday makeup. When I'm like trying to post something for Instagram or I have a meeting, I have to go somewhere, this is what I do. Um, I don't wear anything on my lips, maybe like a lip gloss or something like new, not new, like just glossy and moisturizing. Well, that's it guys. This is what I look like on a daily basis. My eyes are pretty simple, just like to wear eyeliner and then like the, the glowy here. Yeah, like if you haven't subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? do that and I'll post my Instagram up here too so I post more way more often on Instagram and I do funny stories you do want to follow my stories so Instagram is over here go check it out subscribe if you want to no pressure and also please comment below like what you think if you need uh, what kind of videos you want to see Q&A's whatever you guys want to see I do this for you <gasps> Bye guys. Mm -hmm.